And suppose you had something that could get killed and was expensive to replace. That would be just great. Big countries can invade small countries much more easily because they don't have their soldiers being killed. And the risk here is that these robots will malfunction or they'll just be more... No, no. That's Even if the robots do exactly what the people who built the robots want them to do, the risk is that it's going to make big countries invade small countries more often. More often, because they can. Yeah, and it's not a nice thing to do. So it brings down the friction of war. It brings down the cost of doing an invasion. Mm. But, and these machines will be smarter at warfare as well. So they'll be Well, better. even when the machines aren't smarter. So the lethal autonomous weapons, they can make them now. And they, I think all the big defense departments are busy making them. Even if they're not smarter than people, they're still very nasty, scary things. Because I'm thinking that, you know, they could show just a picture, go get this guy. Yeah. And go take out anyone he's been texting and this little wasp. So two days ago, I was visiting a friend of mine in Sussex who had a drone that cost less than £200. And the drone went up. It took a good look at me. And then it could follow me through the woods. Mm -hmm. And it follow It was very spooky having this drone. It was about two meters behind me. It was looking at me. And if I moved over there, it moved over there. It